to introduce you to the Adair family. Uh, we have Brooks and Shelby and then Brooklyn um, right over here who will be baptized here in just a moment. And uh, they are coming today to uh, put their faith, their hope, their trust, and to publicly declare um, that they want Jesus to be Lord and King of their lives. Can you give them a big hand for this? You know, we all end up coming to faith in different ways. There are different things to where we, um, are, we wake up and we see that God has been chasing us um, all of our lives and that he wants us and he wants to have a relationship with us. And for everybody, it's a little bit different. And um, as strange as it may sound, I think it would be fair uh, to say for, uh, for Brooks and for your family that even something like a reoccurrence of cancer can be the thing that um, opens our eyes. Um, even a second diagnosis that's not a happy one. And in the midst of it all, what you're doing today is you're saying, God, I don't know if I understand the plan, but I trust your purpose. And I am so overwhelmed with emotion um, that on a day like this, that we get to celebrate your trust, your family's trust, that you want Jesus to be Lord and King of your life. So uh, Brooks, uh, we love you. We love you deeply. But even bigger than that is God loves you. Jesus loves you deeply. So Brooks, what I'm going to ask you to do is um, I'm going to ask you and Shelby and uh, Brooklyn will do yours whenever we get you up here in the tub is to uh, repeat a confession. Uh, a declaration is really of what it is that you do uh, want Jesus to be your Lord and your King. So um, I'll just ask you both to repeat after me. I believe, I believe that Jesus is the Christ, Jesus is the, Christ the Son of the living God, and I claim him as my Savior. As my Savior. Amen. Let's Amen. give him a hand. <laughs> so Brooks, we're going to baptize you first, and then like we talked about, um, you're going to help baptize your wife and your daughter as well. So Brooks, I'll just ask you to stand uh, center here. And Brooks, it's because of that confession of faith that you believe that Jesus is the Christ, the Son of the living God, that I now baptize you in the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit for the forgiveness of your sins and the gift of the Holy Spirit. Amen. So Shelby, because of your confession that you believe that Jesus is the Christ and you are wanting him to be Lord and King of your life, we now baptize you in the name of the Father, Son, and Spirit for the forgiveness of sins and the gift of the Holy Spirit. I think we've got enough room. I think we do. Brooklyn, I'm going to ask you to repeat the same confession that your mom and dad just made. People have been making for a long time. I believe, I believe that Jesus is the Christ. That Jesus is the Christ. The Son of the Living God. The Son of the Living God. And I claim him. And I claim him as my Savior. As my Savior. Amen. So Brooklyn, it's because of that confession of faith that we now baptize you in the name of the Father. Son and Spirit, for the forgiveness of sins and the gift of the Holy Spirit.